So hi, good afternoon, everyone. We have with us Dr. Spruha. She just got her exam results today for AMC one, and she's cleared the exam. Mm -hmm. So congratulations, doctor. Thank you. Thank you, doctor. All right. Yeah. So Dr. Spruha, uh, tell yeah. us about like your preparation uh, journey so far. How has it been? So I decided about AMC uh, last year, September, and that's when I bought uh, academically. And then I started my preparation seriously from Feb. So for those four months, I did study very seriously, no social media, nothing. And so I think it was focus study was the key. All right. So four months, you said. So it means yeah. it's pretty much doable like in four or five yeah. months. If you have the right sources and right material at your hand, I think it's uh, doable. All right. So uh, please, for uh, our listeners, just tell us, like, how did you navigate through the resources that were provided to you by academically? I mean, what was your preparation mm -hmm. strategy with respect to the PPTs, the mocks, and, you know, the okay. attempt exams or whatever? OK, so I did started studying from Feb, but I used to attend all the lectures. Okay. And I did pay attention to all the lectures. So then when I started uh, studying during Feb, from Feb, I then started directly reading the PPTs and solving the MCQs. But what I did first was first I solved those MCQs and then I went for the PPT because then I knew which topics uh, were my weak points. Okay. So while reading the PPTs, I focused on those weak points. Okay. And then I solved all the high yield MCQs first. Because those high yield MCQs in academically have all the uh, previous year's recalls. Plus, I attended all the recall sessions also, which were really helpful. Because in June, I think there were some recalls also, which did help. So uh, apart from that, Dr. Spruha, a lot of, you know, we hear a lot of buzz about guidelines. Students get confused, uh, mm -hmm. which guidelines to follow, how much to follow. So what is your take on this? So for me, it was very easy because academically provides everything in their PPTs. For example, my favorite were uh, Dr. Swapnil's OBGY lectures because mm -hmm. she used to take us through all the guidelines during her lectures only. So mm -hmm. I thought it was very helpful that during lectures only the guidelines were covered. And then according to the uh, guidelines, some important points were provided in the PPT. And some I made notes during the lectures. So I think if you have the right source, then the guidelines are not a problem. And sometimes if you don't have those guidelines, you can just Google them. It's easy. Right. Yeah. Uh, so doctor, tell us about uh, your uh, blue book and red book. Did you do them? And uh, how much yeah. revision did you attempt for those? Yeah. So for the blue book, uh, I did the blue book twice. First, when I was going to start, when I started in Feb, I started with the blue book itself. Mm -hmm. And then I did all the theories and MCQs. And then at the end also, I did once before exam, the blue book. All right. So I did it twice. And for the red book, I did not go through it thoroughly because some important tables were already covered in the PPTs, uh, like colon, cancer, and everything guideline was present in the PPT. The red table or photo was only given. So I did not focus on that much on the red book. But yeah, blue book, I did twice. OK. And uh, like recalls, I think you've already mentioned that you did from uh, academically, you know, the recall yeah. session. So amongst the yeah. faculty, like, uh, who's your favorite? Uh, my favorite was Dr. Swapni for the lectures, because I thought her lectures were very appropriate. And it she covered all the guidelines. So it was like everything was there in her lecture. OK. So for our listeners, yeah. uh, would you go ahead and recommend academically to them? Yeah, 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 for sure. For those who are going to start the journey, academically is the best place. They will also help you with all the documents. They did send us the PDF also, which documents will be used and everything. So it was really helpful for someone like me who had no idea where to start. All right. So thank you very much yeah. for your valuable yeah. input. I wish you all the very yeah. best for your Thank you. Thank, Thank you. you.